Vincenzo's Gold Crypto Investing, a quick update. Not much is going on in the market. I'm in a travel day again, going back to Central Illinois. So this is going to be a brief update. We'll give you more updates as we're on the road and we have time to settle down. But you can see right now what I've done for you real quick is all my original OGs. Remember the last time we were in a pattern like this, a rising wedge, which is a topping reversal pattern, topping reversal pattern. Remember it back here? That's how we knew when everybody thought Bitcoin was going to continue going to 100,000. We were telling you when I started making videos right into here that we were forming a rounding top as you had pumping volume, right? You had pumping volume, pumping price, bullish. Then you had a crashing volume and an up and sideways consolidation after the pump, right? Very bearish, often a sign the buyers or the bulls are being exhausted as a rounding top is noticed and the sellers or the bears are taking over the market and the price is going to come down and it did. It met the targeted move down at the bottom of the wedge. Now we're essentially doing the same exact thing. We got a restricting price, a rising wedge, wider, narrower, price moves are getting less volatile. You notice crashing volume, up and sideways consolidation as a rounding top is being noticed as the buyers or the bulls are being exhausted and the sellers or the bears are taking over the market and the price is going to come down. And the 200 day moving average is where you're gonna come but the targeted move out of this is right there at $32,000. And I do believe you have a date with that in Bitcoin as this rising wedge can slither up a little bit more, but eventually it's gonna leak out and it's a bearish reversal pattern, topping bearish reversal pattern. Just as this rising wedge was, if you watch any of my videos from April, May, right? We talked about that extensively until it finally broke, right? So that's what's going on in the Bitcoin. Uh, the XRP is not really doing anything this morning. All we're gonna watch out for is it's about to trade into this green ring, right? We're almost there. We got a few more days as we've been calling for that to top out this price. And then the price is going, you know, it could do something like that and then get into here and then it's coming down here initially. And then we're coming even lower. I have a strong confidence that this November crash is going to materialize. Uh, as you can see, the price has stopped going up. A lot of altcoins have started to go down, but I do believe a phenomenal rug pull is on the way uh, and I think it's going to happen in November, right? If it doesn't and it happens in December while well, it's off by a month. But this massive crash is coming. I'm just trying to prepare you and keep you guys out ahead of it, right? So that's what's going on in the XRP. I would watch out for today and tomorrow. Do you pop back up into here or do you come down here and retest lower support at $1.07 or do you get rejected up here along that green ring? So that's what we're going to watch out in the XRP, XLM. You can see we've called that phenomenally beautiful, right? We were going over with here on how you buy and sell support and resistances, right? Because we told you we had that target of 42 cents at the upper green blue ring on this one and it hit it. And then it got supported on the blue ring and now we're getting tightening range. And I think as you tighten out here, I think as soon as you cross this, it's gonna act as resistance and you're gonna drop down to this underneath target down here, right? Or it's here, but the price has moved on. This would be your underneath target I think you're gonna come down to if you can't break up as you run into the screen ring, right? A lot of things going on in the market as I get more time on the road and get back into the swing of things and the traveling is done for a couple of weeks later on today. Extensive updates will come. Peace and love, peace and love.